Hey there, welcome to the journey into the world of programming. My name is Ola Deji, and I'm super excited to kickstart our new brand new channel called Tech Mastery Hub. I've been in the tech game for over 20 years, and it's I'm all about um, helping you to rock it in in programming. So join me in this brand new channel. There's a lot to learn. There will be a lot of fun, you know. This channel will be you know, emphasizing on all things you need to know about programming, about tech as a whole, and even a sprinkle of self-development as you know regarding this um, industry of ours. So let's dive in, dive in into a, a bit into something more cool now. It's called the programmer's mindset. First point I would like to, you to take note of as a programmer or as an intending programmer is programming isn't just about typing lines of codes. It's more about having superpower. And what is that superpower? It's what we call the programmer's mindset. It is the superpower that you know, stands you out as a programmer. Now, let's look deeply at what this programmer's mindset is. It's all about ability to think uniquely. It's all about critical problem solving in a way that unleashes your coding superpowers. So let's dig in a bit more. Now, another interesting point to take note of as a programmer is at its core, the programmer's mindset is like having a super logical brain. We break problems into pieces and find those golden solutions to them. This then stands us out, okay? Now, and here are the secret sauce. The secret sauce to having um, um, a solution to these problems Thinking critically, you know, and piecing them to result into golden solution is um, because we love challenges. As programmers, let's always embrace challenges. We love them. We really love them. And we will, because we will know we'll always um, handle them like that super boss that we are supposed to be. Now, the journey of a programmer never ends. It's another critical point. What does that mean? We need to stay focused. We need to stay curious. We need to always learn because tech keep evolving. Technological tools keep popping up every day. We, the things in tech evolve faster than your favorite Netflix series. So the journey of learning never ends if you want to stay relevant. I've been there 20 years, still relevant, building solutions, catching up with technologies after technologies. So, that is a superpower. That is a, a, a key ingredient to take note of as a programmer that is going to stand out. Now, we are not wolves also. So remember, programmers need to strive in a, in a team. Effective communication is our secret sauce for bringing epic projects to life. That's why lots of wonderful tools out there, like um, GitHub, are enhancing collaboration among teams. They are very important because you can't do this all alone. We must always work in a team. We must always work in a team. We must always work in a team. It builds our power. It builds, you know, that team spirit. It makes things work faster and more effectively. Okay? Never forget that. Resilience is our middle name also. We bounce back faster than anybody thinks. We get bumped, we get, you know, kicked here and there with daily challenges we face as programmers. But like chameleons, we adapt quickly. In the changing world, a single comma missing in your code, as you'll agree with me, can hold you down for a whole day. You'll be worn out. Sometimes you get frustrated. But it's part of the fun. That's why we're unique. That's what makes us programmer. Once you're prepared for all this, especially as a fresher, don't run away. It is what makes you stand out. It is what makes you do what most other humans cannot do. Because we should always be resilient and solve problems. Take note of that. And a quick reminder is to avoid burnouts. They are real. Programming gets you into a lunar life. Collaboration or not, as long as you are on the job, you get to a point year after year, 
you are coding. You are living in codes. You speak the language of the computer more than that of humans. If care is not taken, you lose your sleep. You're having fun, you are enjoying it. You'll be buried into all this. Take care of yourself, don't forget. Exercise, eat well, get enough sleep. Don't ever take these things for granted because in the long run, they have a very trivial effect on us. How do you ensure you don't get burnout? out? Once again, exercise regularly, no matter how little you want to do it. Be mindful of your diet. Try to sleep enough. Choose the time of the day when you are most active, especially if you are a freelancer or a remote worker. You work better at night, do it. You need that extra hour after working hours to work a bit more at night, do it. Whatever you do, don't forget to have enough sleep, whatever enough sleep means to you. And unwind. Don't get trapped in the night life of a programmer while abandoning your family, your friends, and most especially your health. Have fun. Live a bit of a balanced life when you can. These are very important things to take note of. And once again, I will say at Tech Mastery Hub here, our new channel, we're on a mission to supercharge your programming journey. Join me often. We expect more exciting content to drop in as often as you could think. Don't miss out of any of this. Coding, technology as a whole, personal growth, even um, how to make money from all of these tech things of ours. These are some of the things we'll be focusing mainly on on this channel. And if you are as passionate as I am about tech, about programming, do well. Smash the subscribe button here. Give the video a thumbs up. Ring the notification bell. Stay tuned for more epic topics on this channel. And by the way, all I've said in this video is just a hint, an intro, a tip of the iceberg as per setting the mind of a programmer. What you need to know, what you need to prepare for, things you need to pay attention to. But if you're more interested and you have found this very exciting, take a look into a book I have taken time to read and to, to, to write in detail concerning this topic. It's called The Code Craft, The Programmer's Mindset. It is there on Amazon book. The details of the book and the link is in the description of this video below. So do well, take a look at it. And if you like it, get it, give us good reviews because I can assure you it's a very wonderful thing that sets the mind and the pace and the success of every developer, every coder. And who, oh, by the way, thank you once again for joining me on this video. Remember, it is not just about writing code. And it's about thinking. It's about critical problem solving. Stand out, reach your full potential. And I remain your guy, Oladeji. Thanks again for watching.